Hello everyone and we happy Halloween early. Um, I started on this page because of this cool carved pumpkin they've put on the loading page. The lights there and this spooky moon. Anyway, I will see you in a moment when I actually get the game started. But I thought this was cool to share and say happy Halloween. Okay, I'll see you in a second. And we're back, and I can't see a darn thing. What what time is it? Two hours of darkness left. Oh, okay. So I need to try and find my bedroll again. It's here somewhere, right? Metal shelf. Metal shelf. Bye. Can I... No lantern in fuel. Okay, no fuel in lantern. Alright then, let's find our f lantern. This one. Let's give it some fuel. Because otherwise I'll never find my bed. Let's go ahead and light our lantern. See here, I thought I was looking at the floor. Bedroll, there it is. Alright, now we can put out the lantern. And bedroll should be right there. There we go. We're going to sleep for like three hours, because I feel like it. That'll give it a chance to get lighter, because even though it says two hours of darkness, that first hour or two is like really cold and really dark still. Game saving. So in case you're wondering, after the last episode, I I, uh, I did put down the bedroll and so I could sleep, because that's the only way I could save it. So let's bedroll, let's pick it up. Okay, let's check everything out. We are a little bit thirsty. That's okay, I'm a little bit thirsty too. Scratch my nose, take a drink. Sorry for the noise, that was me moving my microphone so I could get my drink to my mouth. How are we for f hunger? Eh, we could, we're a little, teeny little bit. Well, actually, it says we're full, but not peckish. So maybe, you know, maybe we're okay. We are fairly warm. How are we doing on weight? Very, very close. Is there any stuff we don't really need to take with us? Uh, do we really need a torch? No, let's drop the torch. Um, let's organize things by weight. Lantern, we kind of need. Really, that's three pounds? Wow. Okay, yeah, uh, the fuel, yep. Other lantern. Yeah, it's still in good shape. The tools, the knives, more stuff are, s yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Alright, so, get the controls under control. We checked everything. Um, I hope I didn't miss anything. I do see some firewood over there. How are we for firewood, by the way? We've got a little bit. Okay. Cool. No need to worry about that at the moment. Alright, so let's head for the back door and get ourselves out of here. So let's see the door to outside gonna be this way. Back. Back. See, it still said hours of daylight. Two hours of darkness left. What? I think time is frozen. I slept for three hours and it said two hours of darkness left before. Alright. Is time frozen? Is it going to be two hours of darkness forever? That's okay. Well, it's okay. We'll, we'll make our way back to the back exit. And by then, daylight should be dawning. And if not, we'll just take a little nap. Because um, we're in here. There's no sunlight in here anyway. So we need the lantern. We might as well make the best of it. So this is a really big place. Have no clue where in the actual dam we are. And I don't I don't know if you're supposed to. I mean, who knows? Um, there's a workbench. 
Is there anything we needed in the workbench that we could do? I don't think so. Did we check the workbench drawer? I'm pretty sure we did. I'm not going to go back checking things that I'm pretty sure I checked before. Because I'm a pretty thorough person, right? I, I check everything out. The only thing in this map I haven't ever checked was the homestead. Um, Tapper's homestead safe because it just wasn't working for me. And we could go back there sometime and check it out if we needed to. The only problem with leaving stuff way in the back of this dam is it's way in the back of the dam and it's not like it's convenient by the entrance and easy to get to like our firewood we left before. Um, did I go too far? Did I pass the door I want? No, I don't think so. I think the door I want is here. There it is. There is the door I want with the warning that says do not go out this door unless you want to come back. Two hours of darkness left. Let's put our bedroll down. Right there. We're going to extinguish our lantern. Grab our bedroll. Rest for three hours. Two hours of darkness left. It's not changing. This is scaring me, guys. It's like stuck in two hours of darkness. Two hours of darkness left. And I don't, I'm not sure what's going on. Did I, did I just put the storm lantern down? I think I did. Shoot. There's nothing in, okay, there's our bedroll. Uh, where did we put the storm lantern? I can't see anything, guys. Okay. We might have to, um, drastic move. Grab storm lantern number two. Yep, we did. We put down the storm lantern. Great. Refuel. <sighs> okay. Equip. Light our storm lantern. Okay, now we can see our bedroll. We'll pick up our bedroll. Two hours of darkness left. Somehow we put our storm lantern there. Okay, I'm going to exit and be right back. Alright, so I reloaded from the last save. We are back to the um, storm lantern I accidentally put down. I still have it. It's still... I was hoping it would fix itself. It still says about two hours of daylight left. But I'm hoping if we go out, it will fix itself. Because I slept for three more hours and it's still... It still says two hours of darkness left. Hopefully the game will figure it out and fix it soon. Okay, it's pretty chilly out here. How are our stats? We are thirsty. Is this a fire barrel? No, it is not. But we can start a fire out here stay a little bit warm because I think we are cold. Let's go ahead and just drink our water. Cause I don't remember. Obviously that didn't save our drinking from before. Although that sounds really weird. I guess it's from all the sleeping I was doing. Okay, and we are a little bit hungry so we'll go ahead and find something this energy bar that we haven't eaten all of yet. That's a big gulp. Okay, we're better. Didn't change. Okay. Two hours of darkness. Okay, I don't know if it's just me or what, but we're gonna you know what, we're going to put our bedroll down and give it one more try. Alright, let's try this one more time, see if darkness will go away or it's going to be darkness forever. We'll call this two hours till dawn. 
until done. That which I watched other people play, so if you like that game, that was a pretty good game. This will not be that, hopefully. Two hours of darkness left. All right, we're stuck until two hours till dawn. So let's take some, let's look around, see if there's anything we can get from our surroundings. Oh, okay. So we can't go over the pipes. I was hoping maybe we could, could, but we can't. Okay. So there's some pallets. Problem with being out at dark is that you can't really see much of anything. Your lantern like gives you a little bit of view, but not a lot. There's a container we can search. Candy bar, okay. I'll take it. Actually, no, I'm not going to take those. Okay. This is our, our fence. There's some scrap metal. Go around the fence. I don't think we need any more scrap metal. What is this thing? Just a thing, huh? Okay. So weird. It's like a... something. I don't know. It's a ladder or something. I feel like I'm walking really slow. Really, really slow. So what's over here? Got some wood. Okay. Let's head down the stairs. Hmm. It's awfully dark out here. Got some more scrap metal. Trying to tell me to pick up a lot of scrap metal. Oop, there's a, there's a jerry can here. Jerry can. We are encumbered. What can we do about it? Um. Are we hungry? Yeah, we're a little bit hungry. Okay, so we can. What is weighing the most on us? Water. Let's drink a little water. Okay. An MRE. Well, I don't want the MRE, so we'll just eat this candy bar. Lighten our load a little bit. Okay, almost there. What have we got in here? I wonder if making these into tinder plugs makes them weigh any less. I'm going to give it a try. We're going to harvest. Oh, sorry, harvest. Wrong one. That's okay. I don't know if Tinder plugs weigh less than newspaper. We'll give it a try. Apparently, because we are no longer encumbered, we're not going to do all three of them. We're just going to do two for now, and we'll go back. So now, yep, so those weigh a little bit less. This weighs a whole lot. Let's go ahead and harvest this. I guess a rolled up newspaper, I don't know, I, I you would think they would weigh the same, but apparently you're losing some of the material. Okay, we've got five pieces of cloth, that's quite a lot. So that didn't actually change anything. What can we, is there anything we can drop that we don't need? Any clothing? It's really hor- we don't need this really bad hat, do we? Now, let's go ahead and drop this really bad hat. And the heavy wool sweater. It's in bad condition. But I'm guessing if we repair it, it's going to give us more warmth. 
than our thin wool sweater. Either of them. So maybe if we repair it, see how it goes. Yes, use the sewing kit. We're going to use up this one sewing kit before we try anything else. There are still two hours of darkness left. Okay, cool. So what is it up to now for, it's up to 54. It's got a 1.5, which is the same as what we're at. So if we repair it more, we've got plenty of cloth and time. Yep. Should keep us even warmer. Darn, I forgot to put out the lantern while we were doing that. All right, so now it's up to 84. It's got a 2.3. We're gonna, we're gonna wear it. Means we're switched everything off. I know it's horrible. And those jeans, do we really need a pair of ratty jeans? Actions, let's harvest them, I guess. I don't know if that's gonna make any difference in weight, but we'll see. Maybe a little bit. Maybe just a little bit. All right, I think we're good. Okay, so now we need to, oh yes, we need to refuel our lantern. Light our lantern. Temperature. We are very cold. Okay. Okay. Hmm. And we're thirsty again. All right. So let's go ahead and let's. Uh, not that one. It's okay. I will get. I will figure out what we're doing. Start a fire. Not on the wall. No, that would not be a good place to start a fire. Right there. Wood matches, yes. Newsprint, no. We have tinder plugs. There we go. Cedar firewood or reclaimed wood. 30 minutes. That's better. Accelerant. Better. Do we need a one hour fire? Sure. There we go. I was like, why did we move from one side to the other? Okay, let's see what we can... No, I don't want to do that. I want to e heat up these peaches. I don't know why it keeps slipping us around to the other side of the fire. That's kind of confusing, disorienting. Back. And we're gonna eat our peaches. Nope. Eat our peaches. Eat. No, I don't want the. T oh, I don't want the tin of sardines. I want the peaches. Game, you are being slow and annoying. Eat the peaches. Thank you. All right. We should be hung. We should be full, mostly. Okay. We're warming up. Yay! That's good. Okay, and in our fire, we're going to do some water, just a little bit, that's fine. Melt some snow. Still about two hours of darkness left, I think this, this is, that's what this game is going to be. This episode is two hours till dawn because for some reason the time, the time thing is not working. Our, yeah, our time clock's not working. It's stuck at two hours till dawn. I don't know if that's something they did for Halloween. I don't know. I thought I heard noises. Okay, let's drink some of that water.
That's an awfully long time to drink. I guess we were quite thirsty. We're good now. We're, we're pretty good. All right. How much time does the fire have left? 27 minutes. Let's see if we can go around it, not walk through it. That would not be a good thing to walk through the fire. Because that would burn. We'll just leave it going for a little while. Don't need the scrap metal at the moment, I don't think. Anything else hiding around here that is useful? Not that I can see. Not that I can see very much in two hours till dawn. Anything hiding? Nope. Nothing hiding back there. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll uh, start venturing this way. Get a branch. Sure, we'll break that down. About two hours of darkness left. And then we'll pick up some sticks. Too bad you can't do much with sticks. And we're off. So apparently I've been told that that cave I went in in my first playthrough when I came out this way does go somewhere. I just didn't have a lantern or anything going, so I, I didn't know that it went somewhere. This looks a lot different than last time I was here. Hmm, maybe it's part of the updates. They've, like, changed it. I don't know if I'll be able to get back through here. Hopefully I'm going the right way. Uh oh, that, that doesn't look like the right way. What? How did I... What? Did I miss a turn to go down the hill or something? This is totally disconfusing. Disorienting and all that. Trying to see. Okay, so we're back here. Hmm. I mean, I thought, you know, this was the way to go. Did I miss another obvious path choice? So we're back at the gate. Do we have to go this way? This doesn't look safe. That, that, that is not safe. What is... That's my food. Foot. That's my food print. That's my food print. I could have sworn last time there was a path. A very nice, safe path to get us down to the river. Okay, well, maybe we not supposed to go that way. Maybe we not supposed to go that way. I think that's going to be it for today because um, unless I can get it to stop being two hours of till dawn, there's not really much I can do here. Yeah, still two hours till dawn. Stars look pretty though. I I'm I'm truly confused. Oh, is it? No, two hours of day or darkness left, but it looks like it got lighter. Oh, maybe there were clouds out covering the moon? Hmm. Alright, let's try this path one more time, and then if I can't figure out where I'm going, I'm calling it an episode. I was could have sworn you just follow the path, and it'll take you down to the edge of the river. And then you can walk along the river. This is so perplexing, because this looked like it ran into a dead end. I mean, one, this, like, goes through this rocky outcrop here. Okay.
I mean, I guess... Maybe it's safe? Can we go over here and be safe? I guess we can go over here and be safe. A little more rocky than I remembered it from before. Um, does this go anywhere? Is this going to be a dead end? Is this... This is so confusing because it doesn't look anything like it did before. And the fact that it's nighttime is like... Not helping. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're making our way down. Maybe they thought it, the path was too easy last time. And they and the, with the the redos of the game, maybe they've made it a little more difficult pathfinding here. I remember there were crows last time and there was something up there, but I could never get to it. Maybe that has gone as well. All right, we finally made it down here to the edge of the water. The edge. The edge. We're quite cold. I hear a wolf. Perhaps a wolf just killed an animal. I don't know if it's going to how well it's going to work, but I'm going to I'm going to try sleeping down here, guys. We're going to get out our bedroll and put our bedroll down. Can we start a campfire? Can we start a fire? Nope. I want to go back into here. Start a fire. Right there. Not the newsprint, please. The tinder plugs and some cedar and some optional accelerant. Yes, start the fire in the snow next to my sleeping spot and warm us up beautiful we are already getting warm and then I'm gonna take a little nap and hopefully time will correct itself and I'm gonna call it for this episode thanks for watching guys I hope you enjoyed two hours until dawn on the long dark and until next time I've been Dragon Feathers and you're awesome and I'll see you later Bye!